Hey guys, welcome back to Deadman1010 and welcome back to LEGO Batman 2 DC Super Heroes. On the last episode I showed you a glitch video that I did for this game for the outbound stuff within, you know, LEGO Batman and how you could go off over to that bridge that's back round there somewhere or whatever and you can go under it and whatnot and under the under uh, Gotham City, but uh, now on today's episode, I'll be doing a uh, top 10 list for LEGO Batman 2 DC Super Heroes. And the last time I did this was with uh, LEGO Lord of Rings, and that was at the beginning of this year. At the time of recording this, and now we're near the end of 2021, at the time of filming this, and... Uh, we are now doing another top 10 list, and this is going to be the top 10 best characters of LEGO Batman 2. And, uh, yeah, let's get started. So, number 10 is going to be... We're going to go with uh, Aquaman. And the reason why Aquaman is number 10 in this top 10 list is because... Don't get me wrong, he looks cool, and uh, he looks great for a first generation, and uh, the reason why he finds himself on this list is because he can spray people with water, and that helps you out tremendously during the 100% guide when you don't have Robin's hazmat suit on you, and based on that, he can help you out a little bit with some challenges, so that's why he's in this top 10 list. But, the thing is, one thing that does hold him back from being higher is the fact that he cannot swim underwater at, or, underwater or uh, at all. Like, legit, he cannot. He, he just ends up drowning like the rest of the characters in this game. Which is annoying because this is supposed to be the king of the sea, king of Atlantis, and obviously he's drowning in the sea. It's like, it's just... It's just bad. It, it genuinely is, but the one thing that saves him is the fact that he's very, very useful in this game as a whole. And basically, before we get right into this, as in, like, into number 9, the way that my top 10s work is basically I have, like, I have, like, three or four different categories. So basically, I have... My own personal thoughts and feelings, you know, about the design and whatnot of the character. And then whether or not they're any useful in the game, that's, uh, that's kind of slot two of how it goes. And then, basically, how good they, uh, they actually are in gamers and how fun they are to use. That's basically the three categories, basically. There might have been more. I kind of didn't think because, I mean, like, it's been months and months uh, since I've done this. And therefore, I'm um, obviously a little rusty on it. But if you really, really want to know how the top 10s work, then, ju then just go on to my LEGO Batman 3 video of the 100% guide on breaking the ice. And it, uh, and it should tell you, obviously, because I do bring it up in there when I'm talking to... Uh, to uh, Sammy on uh, on Discord, as in like, like that was what I was doing at the time and I did bring it up. So yeah, you can find out on there, I'll give you the link to the video. I'll put it in the description. As well as later if I ever decide to do one, a top 10 worst characters, naturally. Because <laughs> that's how it always goes. But anyway, now that we've run over the rules and regulations, Let's uh, carry on with uh, the top 10 list. So, number 9 is going to be... Uh, is going to be the Riddler. And the reason why Riddler is kind of low on the list is he hasn't really got a whole lot to him. Like, he's got his cane, which does some cool combos. He has some great idle animations as you can tell and the only reason and uh, another reason why he's on the top 10 list is because he is so useful in free play with the Riddler boxes 
as in he's the only guy that can do them. And uh, yeah, he's a bit basic, but he is very, very useful, so therefore he is in the top 10 list. And number number 8, I had to think for a minute, is going to be the penguin. Because he is actually pretty cool, like, he can run as a penguin, which is kind of funny. He can glide, which is also kind of cool. But he has a unique ability where he can lay down penguin bombs, which, des which destroy silver leg objects. And that is so handy. Like, that can help you in the free roaming aspects of this game and the 100% guide. So, he is a very, very useful character. And, uh... He looks cool as a result. I actually do like the look of him, honestly. And uh, he looks good, genuinely. And he is kind of a lot of fun to play as, you know, with his, with his glide ability and whatnot. So that is the penguin at number eight. Now we have number seven, which is the one, the only uh, Green Lantern. And the reason why Green Lantern is at this list well, on this spot at number seven, you just you just saw that, and yeah, that's basically because, well, one, he does look pretty cool. I mean, look at him, and then he can fly, and he looks cool when he's flying, and more to the point, he has a couple of cool constructs, which is a benefit. To, of uh, his that Sinestro never got, which is why Sinestro is going to be in the top 10 worst characters because he never got any constructs and Green Lantern did. So, therefore, that's why he's in the top 10 best. That's why he's in there because of the factor of him having constructs and whatnot. So, there you go. And therefore, he can be a bit of fun to play around as. Number six is the one and only Robin, Tim Drake Virgin. And there's a reason why he is at this spot. And it's because he's not that good. He's Robert. He's annoying and useless. But saying that, he is very, very useful. He is very, very useful in this game. Especially in the free roam with some of his suits. So therefore... He is on this list, and therefore he can be quite a lot of fun to play as. Yes, I am saying that about Robin, or Robert, but uh, hear me out. He he can be kind of a lot of fun to play as. But the big reason why he's on here is because he is a big help throughout the entire game, and uh, therefore he's on the list. Now we have number five. Getting down to the nitty gritty now. We have the one and only Joker. And there is a reason why Mr. J is at this spot. And he looks great. Comes with a Tommy gun. He can electrocute people with his hand buzzer. All of that is great. And that definitely deserves a spot on this list. But the big thing is the fact that he can activate the Joker boxes. So he's very, very useful in that respect and aspects so therefore he's a big big hand in free play especially and therefore he can help you out with the 100% guide of all the levels and such quite easily and therefore that's why he's at this list and he's a well on this spot at this list at number five and he's a lot of fun to play around as as you can see he's pretty cool and his idle animations are fun as well or fun as well so that's the reasoning behind the factor of him being at number five on the list. Number four is the one and only Lex Luthor. And the reason why he's at this list is simply because of his deconstructor cannon. Because it's so useful in so many aspects of this game. Or game. Like, that's the only reason why he's at this list. Or at this spot on this list naturally and Mike has also joined us 
Yeah, I was doing a bit. I was doing a video, mate. Top ten characters of Lego Batman Two. But yeah, that's the reason why Lex Luthor is at number five on the list. And uh, yeah, seems like Mike has gone now. But uh, yeah, that's the reason why he's at number five on this list is because of his, is because of his deconstructor cannon or cannon. So there you go. Number four is is going to be uh who did I say was gonna be in the list? I can't remember. I know that I said Batman, Superman, and Flash, but who else was it? Uh, uh, I don't even know anymore. Okay, number number four in this case is uh, is going to be. Uh, Yeah, we'll go with uh, Brainiac for number four. And uh, the reason why the guy is awesome is because, I mean, look at the detail on this guy. And he can interact with magnets, and he's one of the only guys that can do that. That was interesting. Uh, that's a good song, X's and O's. But, uh, yeah. Brainy, uh, yeah, Brainiac looks uh, very, very cool, guys. He's got amazing details. He can interact with magnets. And he has kind of a magnet walk, which is kind of cool. And he can fly, and he's invincible. So, he's a very, very cool character as a result. And, uh, yeah, that's why he gets the number four spot on this list, in this top ten list of LEGO Batman 2 for the characters. What, Mike? Uh, why? I could have very easily introduced you to that song. It was a big part of my uh, childhood, along with a lot of songs. Like, always ended up listening to it on the radio. So yeah, number three. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll go, Mike. Right. There we go. Let's get him. But yeah. Number uh, three is Flash, guys, and you don't even need to know why he's on this list. It's pretty easy why he's on this list. Because he can run fast, and he has some sweet combos. That's the reason why, and he's just a lot of fun to play around as. And now for number two is the one and only Batman. <laughs> And similarly to Robin, he's very, very useful in the whole entire game, and he's fun to play around as, or around as, because well, he's Batman, and and he's he's just uh, very, very useful in general, and uh, he looks cool, and so do all of his suits. But yeah, now number one is the one, the only. Superman! And there's many reasons why he gets... There's many reasons why he gets number one on this list. Is One of the reasons is because of the factor of him being basically straight up invincible. Another reason is 
He has freeze breath, so you can freeze Robert at your own ledger. And you can laser him good night. So you can do that. But the best part is he can fly, but it's even better with him. Because, you'll see why in a minute. Because, and there's his combos there, and he has a jump down attack there. And all the other characters do, but they're nothing special. Other than Green Lanterns. But, this is the reason why. Because you can have the John Williams theme song playing in the background while he's flying. And it's just amazing. It totally completes him big time. And it's just awesome. Like, he looks amazing while he's flying with that song on in the background. It, it, looks, it looks great. And therefore, that's why he's got number one on the top ten best characters of LEGO Batman 2 DC Superheroes. So yeah, if you guys uh, enjoyed this episode, then uh, like, comment, subscribe, share these videos. If could get out to 60 likes, that'd be great. And yeah, ciao guys.